Coachman Ivan. And Ivan in Yiddish has a connotation of being very mundane, very coarse. Coarse person is this coachman. And he left his coachman on the side road and he went in to do his business. <laughs> and Coachman was parked, and a guard, uh, some type of policeman, came and uh, confronted him and asked him, Verda, meaning to say, What are you doing here? You can't be here. What are you doing here? And um, the coachman, Ivan, he understood that the policeman was asking who he is. So he said, Ivan. And the policeman was incited and uh, very angered and asked with greater anger, Verda! <laughs> and Ivan meekly replied, Ivan! To which the policeman said even with more anger, Verda! <laughs> And Ivan very meekly replied, Ivan, and the policeman started beating the Ivan up, hitting him and beating him, telling him, Verda, Verda! <laughs> and Ivan uh, was meekly saying, Ivan, and he got beaten until the was kicked out of him, made him move away. Then, uh, he met up with Ivan met up with his boss picked him up and um, his boss called him Ivan <laughs> and uh, Ivan took his boss on the side and whispered to him here you can't call me Ivan you have to call me Verda and when they got outside the city Ivan said now you don't have to call me Verda anymore you can call me Ivan <laughs> it was a good story, yeah? Hashem. And the Benu said the same thing that when you're by me, you're Verda. Who are you? You have humility. You get to know, you get to feel a little of a of true, true uh, humbleness, humility, who we are in truth. And when we leave Rabbeinu, then we go back to being Ivan. <laughs> We get back to being coarse and mundane. Should always merit to be Nanach. Nanach Nachman Nachman.